Are you, are you looking for new pillowcases? Hey, look at how they come. I came to Walmart and I got this beautiful set of pillowcases and it comes in this really cute little bag that the same fabric as the pillowcases are in. And I was going to throw the bag away thinking, what am I gonna do with it? And then I realized, stop Diane, it is a perfect little junk journal. So it's got a piece of Velcro on it. And I think it just had like a wrap on it or something like that. It wasn't enclosed in plastic or anything. So as you can see, I've added so much lace and I just was having fun adding lace upon lace. And the journal inside, actually, when you buy the pillowcases, they are wrapped around a piece of folded cardboard. So it fits perfectly in here. So look what I did with the cardboard container. And I added some beads and I covered it with laces. I first covered it with all of my beige papers that are from a couple of my different kits. These are kind of leftover pa papers. And that's the beauty of digital uh, kits because I love the papers and I just print them again and then I have them. So it's all beige. This is a, uh, hold on one second. Yeah, I'm on the right side. This is a, faith junk journal uh i i was thinking about giving it to somebody but i think i'm just going to keep it for myself so what i've done is put lots of spaces and added god's word in here so we've got beautiful these are all coffee dyed papers that i put together and cut down so it's full of bible verses and whatever you ask in prayer will receive if you have faith matthew 21 22 where do you get all this I have a couple kits that are full of Bible verses and ephemera that are just wonderful. This is a little piece of a little corner of lace. Do not be anxious about anything. Philippians 4, 6. Jesus, these are some tags from some of my kits. This is a little tuck spot and this is a prayer card from a Catholic store. And obviously it's um, the Virgin Mary and, and Jesus. I just love the antique, the art. I love the vintage art that, that's on that. And I did some stamping. And then again, I have a little kit with lots of fun little um, pieces of ephemera. Trust in the Lord. Look at this great stuff. I have so much fun stuff that I've been collecting for a long time. If by faith you are in Christ, God is as much for you in Christ as he will ever be or ever could be. That's a quote from John Piper. My uh, All About Faith, I think that's the name of it. I will put it here. That's where some of these quotes are from. And here's, again, some more tickets that I make. This is Colossians 2, 6 through 7. Some beautiful lacy stuff with pearls. Being rooted in God's word with a doily, some more lace. Only in God is there fullness of joy. That's from one of my joy kits. I have a couple of joy kits. Whoever believes in me shall never die. That is actually ribbon that I've had for 20 years. And I finally pulled it out and went, I'm going to put it in things. God is, holy is the Lord, excuse me. And this says, I will sing of my Redeemer. Aren't these beautiful? I made this whole little vintage set of um, quotes and Bible verses. And this is just some extra little paper. Somebody wanted to journal. His name is holy. This I made, um, I said, I need to make a video of doing this. This was so much fun. I just took book pages from a Christian book and folded them and made little envelopes. And so I think I put something in here. Yeah, I just put a little uh, song sheet. To God, our hearts we lift. And then you just add some ephemera on top. And it's so pretty. And then I sewed it on with my sewing machine. For nothing will be impossible with God. Luke 137. Psalm 118.1. Oh, give thanks to the Lord for he is good. For his steadfast love endures forever. And then this, I my neighbor gives me all of the little devotions that he gets every month from one of the one of the pastors, I can't remember. And in the back, there's a, a devotion for every day, and they're just perfectly small-sized Bible verses. And so I cut them out and use them on ATC cards, and I put them in journals, and that's what I did with that one. I have chosen the way of faithfulness, and here's one of my cards that says, my favorite scripture, so you could write uh, scripture. So if you were making this and giving it to somebody, then you could put your favorite scripture on there, and hopefully then you're sending that message. 
you never let go. Another little card. Whatever you ask in prayer, you will receive if you have faith. A little tuck spot. Another little tiny envelope. And I put um, God's word inside of there. Max Lucado said, faith is not the belief that God will do what you want. It is the belief that God will do what is right. And that's so important because God is not a genie. He is not a magic genie that will give you everything you th think you want. Another one of my favorite scripture cards, another little tag, another ticket. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. So lots of lace. Another one of my little envelopes. And I have some stuff in here too. Let's see if I can get it out. Oh, it keeps going down farther. It's so tiny. There is just a piece that you could just do some journaling on that I tucked in there. But his grace is enough. Galatians. I have been crucified with Christ. It is no longer I who live, but Christ who lives in me. More little tuck spots. Your faithfulness endures forever. And whatever you ask in prayer, you will receive if you have faith. Matthew 6, 21, 22. Heavenly love and God will wipe away every tear from their eyes. There shall be no more death nor sorrow, nor crying. There shall be no more pain, for the former things have passed away. Revelation 21.4. One of my uh, stamps from my ephemera kit. Love, continue steadfastly in prayer, being watchful in it with thanksgiving. Colossians 4.2. Lots more lace. My lace, a lot of it's from Timu. Some of it is from Taperology, but I would not buy lace from there, there again. Way too expensive for what you get. Get a much better deal at Timu. Uh, from one of my ephemera kits, a uh, little devotional that I included in here. Then again, some of that old ribbon, I am the way, the truth, and the life. And that's my little journal. I hope you like it. And I hope I've inspired you to not throw away things that look like junk when you first look at them. But look at this beautiful, this would be a wonderful gift. Wouldn't this be a great gift to make for somebody's wedding, like, right? Because you could put all verses in there for them about marriage and things like that. Be a great birthday gift, great Mother's Day gift. I could think of lots of gifts that you can do it for. So I hope I've inspired you to make your own Faith Art Junk Journal. Get my kits. My kits all are, have faith in them. So they're beautiful papers, digital papers, and then you get wonderful God's Word in there. I'm going to close us in prayer. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face to you and give you peace. Numbers 6, 24 to 26.